Welcome back to Mr. Sealy P on tour and I find myself today at Carlisle. We are at Rickaby's at Carlisle. This is a class dealership. Now I know class isn't in game. I know it's not um, and it's one of those on the wish list of things we would love to have in game. I'm just going to walk forward here because next to me is a class action and it is absolutely huge just here. I'm going to go around, I'm going to take some footage, we're going to look at a few of the tractors, I've got to get that right way around. She's a beaut. Uh, so yeah, same as I did before, we're going to have a wander around, have a look at a few of the vehicles. The guys here at Rickaby's at Carlisle have been absolutely fantastic. Um, had a chat with them inside, the manager said to come around, take pictures and stuff of anything I want to, so um, that's exactly what I'm going to do. So seeing as I'm standing right next to it, we'll start off with the Class Axion 800. This thing is huge. This is about the same sort of size, I think, as the uh, the New Holland T7 that we looked at the other day when we were down at Lloyd. Um, but lovely Trelleborgs on it. And like I say, I know class isn't in game, but if you're interested in tractors even slightly, then it's an absolute, you know, it's a must to come to a dealership. Now I spoke to the guys in here, and they um, not only is it just a sales place, they uh, service. And the guy said they service the harvesters all the way up to the largest ones. They do forage harvesters, the class Jaguars. Um, so it's all pretty exciting. If I spin around, we get silly G in a minute. Loving life. Um, we've got a line up across the front of various different class bits of machinery. And this is the Rickabees. As you can see over there, Rickabees class. Um, but they've also got other machinery they sell. They don't just stock class equipment. They've got various different slurry tankers and they've got manure, uh, fertilizer spreaders and feed wagons and all sorts of stuff so we'll head over i think we've got some slightly smaller um, vehicles so slightly smaller down the range a little bit we've got a class 440 arion i've only ever seen the axions really but these are brand spanking new absolutely amazing Lovely bits of machinery. I couldn't get a... And then over to the side, we've got a class round baler, a Roland 375RC. Inside, if you, I don't know if you collect, if you collect models like I do, farm vehicles, they've got some fantastic special editions. They did the Rickaby Show, um, and they've got um, a harvester with Union Jack and Rickaby Show uh, windrower. Class, I honestly didn't know how much stuff they made. Class Volto 52 windrower. And then we've got to the front here, we've got a class front mower. This is a Corto, I believe. Where is it? There we go. Corto 3200 or 3200F. And just to get an idea of the size of it, CLEG, would you mind standing next to it? Look at the size of it. Not CLEG, obviously, the mower. <laughs> <laughs> and then we got even smaller down this end now Silly G said this is more her size tractor this is her tractor she likes this a class 230 Elios that's actually more your size that's nice front loader attachment on this as well got a wheel loader just going off of there and then behind that we've got a wheel loader I didn't even know Class did wheel loaders with its boom up. So we have a quick whiz over. And obviously that's, um, I'm assuming that's a wind, no that's a tedder. I said that was a wind rower. That's a tedder, isn't it? Yeah. There's a wind rower over there, definitely. But anyway, um, so yeah, Class Scorpion. Looks a little bit like the Manitou we looked at the other day. 74 is that 74 l i think or 741 very power very very cool awesome awesome bits of kit here i have to say the back of the elios there and that's that's definitely a wind rower yeah. <laughs> that's definitely a wind rower not a ferris wheel it is massive like i say you play with them in game and you don't realize the actual size of them Very, very big. Then over to the side, we've got oh, a bale wrapper. 
that's not a class one that's a tanko tanko um, i said in one of my last episodes they had the tanko wrapped bale handler they actually make um bale wrappers didn't know that a couple more class arians 420s just over here and then they've got some other equipment Schaffer, Schaefer, I'm not too sure. Schaefer, um, they're kind of like wheel loaders. They're a little bit like the um, Kramers. Very nice bits of machinery. And then come around to the front of the building, we've got various different mowers, from various different companies. I think we've got a bale shredder just there. Uh, manure forks, silage cutters. What else have we got around the side here? bale grabs I say the size of them is absolutely massive Foster I've never heard of those so that's a bale shredder I'm not sure there you go roller mill Wakely roller mill never heard of that five ten dollar mill Foster trailer then we've got side attachments. I think these are for um, hedge trimmers, I believe. Go on the back of the three-point linkage. I'm sure they're hedge trimmers. And there's even more going further around. This place is amazing. And as you probably noticed, this um, uh, vlog is slightly longer than the last one. There's far more machinery out the front here. So that's the kid, that's the bell shredder. We've got a kid mower at the front there. I think the same thing we've got at the back there is a uh, Oh no, that's a, uh, what do they call it, like a pile driver. Is that a fence post? Looking at that, with the different uh, numbers up the sides and the block on the bottom. Now I think we've got a, is that a weeder? Mulch harrow, something like that. Weeder or mulch har harrow. Hats and Bickler, no way. There you go, that's a Hats and Bickler. Just like the big stuff in the Big Bud DLC, that's a Hats and Bickler. Mulch harrow, rollers. And then we've got an Abbey food mixer, spreader. Then over to the side here, we've got Bailey trailer. Now that is huge. That is massive. Side so extension boards on the side there. Bailey flat trailer. I was so hoping, oh no, they have. <laughs> I was gonna say, I was so hoping over here towards the back, they had some um, forage harvesters and they do. Just through there, they've got a couple of forage harvesters. If I can get close enough to the fence, got a couple of class Jaguar. Got a 950 and a 970, is it? Just through there. I can poke that through. Just there. Very, very nice indeed. I haven't seen a class Zerion, which is a pity. What I'm going to do, sorry for the wobble, I'm going to try and zoom in a little bit on that. There we go. A couple of forage harvesters. No actual combines, unfortunately, which is a pity. I was hoping they were going to have one. So, coming back around. So, moving on from the forage harvesters, we've got a Marshall trailer. That's a friend of mine. There are Marshall trailers in game. It's nice to see them all close and personal. Another flatbed Bailey trailer. Another Abbey food mixer. That's a slightly older one. I can tell by that. Yeah, 1450 feed mixer. Very, very cool. And then we've got some more couple Arians. The other ones were four, 420s, were they? 440s? We've got 620s, so slightly larger Arians here. It's all very exciting. I, I'm trying not to rush round because. You know, it's not very often you get to look around these kind of things. Like I say, the guys here have been fantastic. There you go, Farm Dog. It's Farm Dog's birthday today. He's one. One whole year old today. Still, unfortunately, acting like a buffoon. It's time he grew up. Grow up, dog. I'm joking. <laughs> another, there we go, another 650 Arion. Now to the side here, we've got a Bunning Agricultural Engineers. Lowlander Mark IV. That is a muck spreader. Nice, got a muck spreader. Uh, another Volso. That is a tedder, isn't it? That's definitely a tedder. I think I'd know by now, wouldn't you? I so hope Class do sign a deal at some point. But there you go, the back end of the muck spreader. And I just want 
outside we've got a slurry spreader just there and I'll tell you what I have missed just over here just in the other side of these the size of that Bailey trailer that is huge we got a three-point link mounted fertilizer sprayer boom sprayer bargain there you go that's very nice I wonder what the extent is on that what the reach of that boom is but that is huge there's a lot of levels to that that's one fold Is it from me? Oh, it's a high spec, high spec 2000. No way. Got one of those in game. I used one of those on uh, Golden Days of Farming. There's a high spec 2000. I think it's a high spec 3000 in game. But there you go. In game mods. Awesome. That's it from me on this vlog number three um, from Rickabees at Carlisle, the class dealership. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have enjoyed it in some way, shape or form, give us a like. If you don't subscribe yet, please do. If you want to leave a comment, feel free. And if you want to share this video, then please be my guest. I'm just going to quickly spin around so we can see it behind me. There we go. And we'll spin around and have a look at the uh, action one last time. Whatever you should choose to do. As always, thanks for watching.